What's up guys? We get zero views here. My name is Talos and of course we are back with some more Final Fantasy VII Rebirth and we just had an epic battle, a boss fight if you will, at the previous part if you haven't already seen that one. But yes, we are back. Um, we kind of told Tiffany. Uh, uh, we kind of told um, Sephira here that uh, you know we're, we're, we're trying to be a hero and whatnot. And that's when that's what we went ahead and said to uh, Tifa here that yes, you are going to stay back. This NPC will protect you. He probably won't. But uh, this is the scene that I was talking about in the previous episode that's going to dramatically change how we feel about our boy here, Sephira. At least the you know the story idea. Like most people would probably think he's still cool. But anyway, let's proceed. Oh wait, there's, there's just items here. I gotta check for items. That's just how I roll. That's how I roll the boat. I don't think there is. Yeah, okay, never mind. Forget you then. Didn't expect it to be all systems go. You'd think it'd be running at reduced output, like most last-gen models. Then let me guess. Villagers don't have a clue about this. Knowing Shinra? Of course not. The company really needs to be more transparent. <laughs> Tell that to the president. What exactly is the problem with this place? The people in charge. While most reactors are under the jurisdiction of urban planning, this one is overseen by R&D. Huh. Why do I suddenly have a bad feeling about this? Whatever you see here, you are not to speak of it. It's classified. All right. Now it's probably a conversation for the elevator, but uh, we had it in the hallway. <laughs> now it's just silence. <laughs> so awkward. <laughs> Don't tell me there's another boss fight. The big ass area always scares me. We just had an epic boss fight. Turn this right. Uh, it's an indestructible crate apparently. Wow. Where's the go? Here? Okay. In the right direction. That was downstairs. Okay, never mind. Oh, here. Getting ominous. Uh, oh, I think, I think this is it. I think this is the part. Well, maybe not. I don't think it's that soon, but it could be. Can I go through here? No, it's blocked. I'm walking, like I can't even run, so it, yeah, this is the scene. Yep, this is it! Oh, damn! Okay, I'll be quiet. I'm, I'm sorry. I'll shut up. Oh, damn. Yee! Hojo, you are really something. That's Hojo's response. Oh my God. What are those things? What do you know? What are you hiding? Even though I know, but... Oh, there it is. Genova. Genova? Wasn't that... Oh, damn you. The 
malfunction must be forcing the pods to depressurize. Cloud, go out and shut off the valve. Copy. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. I'm nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous about this scene. They gotta make this scene good. I need to hold both. Oh my god. Would they have the feedback too, by the way, guys? Obviously, uh, like, it was kind of hard to, like, to hold those button, those trigger buttons down. Yeah, actually feel like, like the resist, the resistance is getting harder. That's crazy. Again? Oh my, <laughs> it's so hard to pull these things. I love have the feedback. Huh? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, here it is. What are you doing? These pods were built for the production of artificial materia. But Hojo repurposed them as incubators, cages for animals, and shields with Mako. All to birth a new breed of monster. But he didn't stop at animals. Oh no. There were other subjects. Look. Seems good. This seems very good. <laughs> Am I even human? Eventually, we went back to the inn. But when we got there, Sephiroth locked himself in his room. The mayor had been looking forward to having dinner with bona fide soldiers. So, he didn't take the news too well. Dad had to put up with his belly aching for hours afterward. Huh? Hmm? Must have sucked. But what about Sephiroth? What happened to him? He left. Didn't tell a soul where he was going. So yeah, I like how they kind of, uh, with, with the music and everything, they, they had no music to kind of build in that tension. And then they brought in the piano, like, ooh, that gives you a, a chill down my spine. That's why this game is awesome. Gives you that, like, the tension, suspense, action, drama, comedy. Oh my god. That's why I love games like this. That's what makes you feel alive. I do like the map too, by the way. If you look, if you zoom into the map real quick, like um, over that, that mini map, like you can see that I'm upstairs. I like I like that attention detail. A lot of people won't, won't really notice that, but as someone that wanted to be a game designer at one point in my life, like I, I follow like a lot of different aspects, like 
uh, level design, character development, story, boards, uh, map, map designs, interface, uh, AI, uh, all that jazz. I met it's, it's amazing the technology right nowadays. And he acted like I wasn't even there. Busy, I suppose. Music engineering as well, sound design. Oh my God, everything. Like, I tried. I tried to like really en en engulf myself in game design, and even like to to now sort to to some extent. But obviously, I'm like way too busy to even think about making a game. But I do appreciate it when it's a, when it's when it's done right, especially when it's done right. Looking for Safara? He just left. I'm afraid. Maybe he needed some fresh air. And also voice acting as well, especially if it's done correctly as well. Not, not that corny stuff, um, like corny dialogue or Severus. if it doesn't make sense. Uh, I did see him leave a little while ago. Who are you though? You're like, like this guy look feel, feels like important, like the way his the, the design is. Like it makes it sound like he's like an important character. Don't know what B got I don't know. Is, is that but name familiar to anybody? I don't know. If, if Riven is watching this, let, 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 who is this guy? Who is this guy? Haven't heard anything about the reactor either. What happened up there anyway? Yeah, yeah, that's classified. He's holed up inside the mansion. Something's been off ever since he came back from the reactor. Too much exposure to Mako? Then we ought to bring him some medicine. What are you running to? I wasn't being nosy. Get out of there! Oh, they're going to the mansion probably. I think they're headed to the mansion. Like, why are you so fast? Unless I'm just like casually jogging. than the reactor the company used to conduct research there back when they were still a small manufacturer even so the rent on that plot was basically what kept the village afloat mm. well, here we are what now i mean the whole place is pitch black you think he's sleeping or something? E maybe he needs our help him a little mako poisoning isn't gonna hurt a living legend Let me talk to you or something. Go and check on Sephiroth for us, will you? Hurry, please. You got scared? Got scared? I'm, 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 I'm a little scared, especially because I know it's what happened. So for the most part, they kept this pretty much true to the original. They definitely expanded on it, that's for sure. Which I definitely, definitely appreciate as a fan, because it um, having this type of technology and whatever. Because back in th those times, it was very hard to like make everything like CGI cutscenes or like cutscenes every let the right dialogue and all that jazz. I think it was like 997, right? Um, so um, now they're gonna kind of expand on it, put some character development, add some FPCs, um, you know, add some depth. So yeah, I'm definitely, definitely loving the, uh, the extension to this part. This is definitely um, one of the, the most important parts of the game. This is the, 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 the turning point, if you will. Especially uh, in the original game, because it was so short, well, shorter. Um, it was still like a three disc thing, but this really, really uh, expands on that meta. And I love it. I love, every, I love every inch of this. Look at this character design. Look at this, I mean, this, this how interior design. Like this is like one of those like things where like, Took a look around the place. As like a game designer, like PC. there's like so much minute details here, like the the books, the the, um, the cups sitting on the table, um, the piano. Like you, you don't need to add all these things, but it adds a level of like like a, almost like a story within a story. Like um, like you could tell the history of this place. Like oh yeah, it's been you know lived on, it's been not taken care of. Um, almost like you're walking into like the. Uh, Beauty and the Beast in his castle, like if it was kind of like that kind of vibe, like just not taken care of. And most people will just kind of like pass through that without actually looking around. Um, so to kind of appreciate the level of design and details, and I, and I love that. And apparently, it's a fact, uh, uh, like an underground layer here. Never knew it had a basement. Was news to me too. 
didn't doubt anyone in the village had a clue. I mean, anybody can just go inside and open it. <laughs> there was no passcode. I wonder if we're gonna fight Sephiroth again. That'd be kind of early to fight Sephiroth, but I mean, we fought Sephiroth like m multiple times in part one. So I'll be kind of su surprised. Okay, I feel like that's where we need to go. Maybe. Oh no, there's Sephiroth right there. The one's still, the, the one's over here. Oh, it's locked, okay. Good thing I checked. Now, just for just for comparison, um, this is what looks. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna flat, flash up like a picture right now, um, but this this was how it looked like in the original FF7, like this particular lab in this scene. Now, flash back to this. What a difference! What a difference! And that's why I appreciate every nook and cranny of this area. Excavated from a two thousand year old rock layer, a life form in stasis. Professor Gast named this life form Genova MEGL 77 1977. Genova verified as an ancient uh, MEGL 913 1977. Genova project approved. So they named the life form Genova. And once they understood what she was, they grew ambitious. The, the music. Sephiroth. The music. What you got there? Leave me be. When a music design is done well, like you, you can feel the tension in his voice. Dead and dead and. Reading. <laughs> Makes it feel like a scary game now. <laughs> with that creepy, like, I don't know, almost Resident Evil sound effect with the strings. We got Genova. A locked reactor door. The name of Sephiroth's mother. An ancient. Ah, screw it. Racking my brain's not gonna get me anywhere. May as well just ask the guy. Are you sure? Are you sure? May as well we progress the story, so yes, we are sure. Across the most fascinating it's, passage. It's the meter. That's the suffer we know. The specimen found in strata dating back 2,000 years smiled with what could only be described as ethereal grace. Though the truth eluded me at first, I later determined that she was an ancient or a steward of the planet, as they are referred to in legend. She needed a name. And so Geneva theme song. Genova. Geneva. Genova. <laughs> the Genova project was approved soon after. A bold initiative to resurrect the long dead ancients. An initiative that resulted in my conception. Oh my god, so good. Or rather, the voice acting is so good. The crowning glory of Professor Gas. Wondrous experiment. Oh my god, this is so intense. He created you?
This is legit. I should go. Good design there. Good design. Mother is waiting. Hey. Hey, hold on. Don't get in my way, Cloud. I keep asking myself, why couldn't I have come too sooner? It's not your fault, man. He was gonna find out anyway. I Maybe I could have saved the village. Or tried, at least. Oh boy, here it is. Here it is! The scene! What? This is the scene! Oh my god. I love this part, but also, my god, the, the emotion. Hey, you. Get in there. The villagers need your help. I know, I know. I'm getting, I'm, oh my god, save, save your, your, the children. Save the women. Okay, I guess I can't go that way. Oh shoot. I must have like got knocked out or something or... Because it, it seemed like I was like out for a little while. Let me through, my oh, I'm limping! I'm sorry, he's gone! Oh my god, come on! Oh shit. This is how you build tension. I love it. Is it true? Sephiroth did this? Oh, it was him. See, games need like games need this, you know. God. Get your head straight. I need you to secure the way out now. Yes, sir. Oh my god. But he Why would he He went mad, of course. The mad titan. Even though that's from Marvel. <laughs> oh my god. The, the mayor. What can I do to help me? Eh? Well. I wonder if like like Wartega like will like help out at all in this endeavor. Probably not. Or is it blocked? Okay, this is blocked. Can't go that way. Oh my god. I appreciate the tension, but this is too slow. Oh my god, the music though. Anyone here? I know I'm getting there. Drag I'm dragging feet right now. Oh my god. Suspense is killing me. I doubt there's any items to lo loot, so we're just progressing right now. I don't think Cloud would care about items on the floor or chests during this traumatic scene. Please. Please be okay. Oh, he's talking about his mom. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Why is it in the person's hands? 
Oh no. Here it is. Run away. Oh shit, I can't see her. You have to leave. You have to live. Oh my god. Hey! Hey! Hang in there! You're gonna be okay! Don't worry. I got you. Come on, let's get you up. I'm dragging now. I'm literally dragging. Oh my god, the freaking haptic feedback. It's so hard to freaking press the L2 button. There he is. I mean, once you get it going, you can, you can definitely pull the trigger for sure, but the initial pull, man. But I love, I love it. Using haptic feedback plus what's happening. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is a great scene. They really expanded this. I'm, and I'm, I'm very, very appreciative of it as a fan. Oh my god. I like how they don't try to shoot him. Like, are you scared to shoot him? Oh my god, now they're to press both? Come on, get in there! The mayor. That is some graphic shit. Granted, they don't show it, but damn, the input. The, the, my God. And his, his boots are so shiny. I don't know how he keeps boots so shiny. Wait for me. I'm coming. So why he doesn't try to kill Cloud? Like why kill why kill everyone else except for Cloud? Unless he tried to. I, I forgot. Oh, this is the scene. Yes, you gotta have it. You gotta have this. followed Sephiroth all the way back to the reactor. Dad and I had gone there to hide. When Sephiroth showed up, Dad decided that he was going to confront him. Oh boy. Oh boy. Dad. It was Sephiroth. Wasn't it? He did this, didn't he? <laughs> Sephiroth. Soldiers. Mako. Shinra. That's why. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of all of this. <laughs> This is a good scene.
brother. I have come for you. Now, open the way for me. You murdered my dad! You burned my village! <gasps> Look, you're still alive, but damn! Boy, here it is. Oh my god. Here I am, your son. Mother, together we will reclaim our world. And I know exactly how we can do that. The promised land. Sephiroth! again the ones who robbed you of the planet your planet but there's no need to be sad mother god because i'm so still intense now and forever so intense My mom. You killed Tifa. My village. My home. <laughs> they were mine by right. This planet, too. For I have been chosen. I believed in you. No. Not you! Whoever the hell you are! God, so intense! God, freaking hell! The goosebumps right now. Oh, am I fighting? Am I fighting? <laughs> I'm not ready yet. thing I remember. The rest is a blank. The hell it is? What happened? It was all over the news. I remember watching it with my mom. They said he went missing during a training exercise. But then, the story changed. A couple days later, they started reporting that he was killed in action. Yeah, that was it. The news outlets are nothing but Shinra mouthpieces spewing propaganda. Only dumbasses believe that shit. Question. Does that make me dumbass? <laughs> uh, I, I, like, I like how she kind of lightened the mood a little bit. Appreciate that. Shinra for manipulating honest folks. It doesn't matter what they said back then. Sephiroth was in Midgar. We fought him. 
Whatever happened, he's alive. Don't know about alive so much as around. But why come back now? After five years, doing who knows what. Because he wants to finish what he started. He wants to reclaim his birthright and rule over the planet with Jenova at his side. After five years? Yeah. Not to sound like a broken record, but it's really bothering me. Well, what's bothering me is all this Genova stuff. Excuse me. Guess the travel or something really did a number on my back. Feels as stiff as a board. Let me take a look. Mm. Ah! Wow. <laughs> You weren't kidding, were you? Let's get you back to the room. <laughs> yeah, let's just call it a night. No amount of guesswork will get us any closer to the truth. So how about we give our heads a rest? <sighs> yeah, I'll sponder, I'll sponder us. I'm the sophisticated Red oh, 13. No, you don't. That bed's <laughs> Sweet dreams. See you tomorrow. Uh, that was a good transition from all that tension. Yeah, that, that, that's a good uh, transition. Good pacing, very good pacing. Oh, I can see their feet. What? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh my god. Why? I was wondering, what's Cloud been doing these past five years? Where's he been? And your. Asking me this? Mm hmm Just had a feeling you'd know. She does not know. Probably did, at one point. All that stuff was taken from me, though. Or... Maybe erased? Oh. By whispers? Yeah. Maybe that's why. Why what? <laughs> this is going to sound crazy, but as far as I know, Cloud was never in Nibelheim five years ago. Whew. This is going to be a longer episode, but there's a lot of story happening right now and I definitely want to get into this. I'm sure you guys as well want to know. Cloud, you up? You don't have to bring your sword, man. It's Tifa. Just Tifa. But I guess that's just part of my design. All right. Well, I thought was, I thought it was gonna be more cutscenes after that, but this seems like a pretty good, pretty excellent and onto two, onto two. I'm just making up words right now. Uh, stopping point. But anyway, thank you guys so much for sticking around. Obviously, this is one of the the best scenes so far in this game, and obviously even in the previous games, like the original, like that was like the point, the point of like turnover and how like now we have a, an objective really to stop Saffron. so that had to be perfect and they went beyond perfect in my expectations i'm not sure what you guys th think in the comments down below let me know but i think they pulled it off excellently and right to the point and still stayed true to the main even though they, they expanded obviously there's uh, some extra stuff on there that they were able to elaborate more on but they cut the true to the original and i love it as a as a fan as a purist if you will but i do i do like the idea of like adding the whispers to some degree like that didn't really hinder the story that much in the previous but um now 
we're getting really into the depth, like the main plot really of Rebirth. And now it makes more sense why they call it Rebirth. But um, yeah, anyway, enough rambling, a lot more to go on in uh, FF7 Rebirth. And thank you guys so much for view, and I'll definitely see you there. My name is Talos, this is FF7 or FF7 Rebirth, and I'll see you there. Peace.